In this video, I'm going to show you how you can have vertical text in Elementor. Uh, for example, vertical text like this or like this. So vertical text, having vertical text is not a built-in feature in Elementor. Uh, but I'm going to use a simple one-line CSS code to do that. But do not worry if you don't have, have any idea about CSS or how it works. Just follow along with me. It is very easy. Uh, so firstly let me just do one thing so let me just explain to you what I'm going to do uh, so this is a, just a layout I have opened up in Elementor so it's a, like a flash sale kind of flash sale setup so what I'm going to do I'm going to add a vertical text beside this image which will say 50% off so let me just go ahead and try to do that let me just first firstly add this one let me add a color to it dark blue uh, for let me add a font style poppy and make it upper piece and then uh, let me make it a little bit bigger 50 pixels okay now what I'm going to do I'm going to change the text to 50% of on t-shirts fifty percent off on t-shirts okay so this is the text so what I'm going to do right now I'm going to add this thing class copy this class so I'm going to provide this code uh, down in the description below so you can get copy and paste from there. So let me firstly co copy this part class and then keep this text selected and go to advanced and paste it in this field CSS classes. Okay. So after doing that, let me copy this part over here copy and then paste it over here in under custom CSS see now it turns vertical okay so now you have the text selected but now it looks uh, kind of weird in a very weird position so click over here under positioning and turn the absolute positioning on so and then use this vertical orientation to move it a little bit bottom right over here maybe a bit more okay now use this horizontal offset to move this on this side so now you have the vertical text over here 50 percent off or t-shirts let me just do that again let me just move it a bit bit further away from the image just use the horizontal positioning option okay so now that's done okay so now that's done so uh, you can also use your mouse cursor but uh, using the mouse cursor becomes a bit difficult so I prefer you just select this and under positioning use this uh, this uh, sliders over here to change the positioning of the text after you have made it vertical okay so now okay so what if now you want the text to read from bottom to up like you want to say uh, you want the text to say 50% off uh, you want to say the 50% from over here from the bottom so so you want to read it from the bottom to top so to do that what you need to do is you need to select the text Go to this custom CSS where you have pasted the code and just uh, make it negative 90, minus 90 degree, minus 90. So this will make the, it just turn it upside down. And now you can read it from bottom to top, 50% off on all t-shirts. So you can make uh, further adjustment uh, vertically if needed. 
under positioning you can just vertical orientation you can just move it up and down so no problem with that so let me just save it start again okay so what if you want to turn other text uh, vertical to what you're going to do so that's very easy just select this text and just after doing this thing to the other text just Suppose you want to also make this text over here vertical Just choose this text over here and in the classes just paste in vertical so it will turn vertical uh, And just uh, use the absolute positioning under here Turn the positioning absolute and then use the sliders to move it around uh, But I'm not going to make it vertical. So I'm just going to remove this Okay, let me just save it as draft again Okay, so once again, I'm providing this codes down in the description below. Just copy and paste it from here uh, in the places which I've uh, told you. And if this video, uh, if this video helped you out, then please like this video and please subscribe to my channel and share these videos to with your friends who are currently using Elementor to build website for themselves or for their clients. And you can also visit my website tazvirwebsolutions.com. So let's meet the. You can visit my website tazvirwebsolutions.com. In this website, you will find uh, lots of helpful box regarding Elementor and other page builders such as Thrive Architect or Gutenberg, etc. So make sure to visit the, uh, visit this website. So thank you for watching this. Have a great day.